Uh, my name is Dan Fergal. Uh, me, personally, I am like a, the manager here. Um, I do a lot of the front end stuff and then basically whatever else Margaret, the owner, she tells me to do kind of thing. I'm just trying to follow in her footsteps, whatever she needs me to do, so. Uh, but yeah, it was in 2010 and it started because they had a, you know, a vision of something that they wanted to do. Um, her husband's family owned a bakery um, in Cortland that was around for a long time, very successful and things like that. So a lot of the recipes and things that we use today and here um, are stuff that have been passed on from them back in the day. And um, it's always just something that they wanted to do. So I kind of tagged along after I got out of college and I haven't left since. Uh, me personally, I mean, like I said, I do anything Margaret tells me to do. I just kind of do anything. But macaroons are always one. And then um, just for the most part, what I do is just a lot of, like I said, front end stuff and taking care of customers and making sure whatever I can do to lighten the load for her so she can concentrate. She is the main maker here. So whatever I can do to help out is what I do. Okay. I always like to try something, you know, different. We always like, again, half moons are, you know, one of the most popular things that we have here. So anytime we go, we like to test out the market. We always like to see what everybody else has. But a lot of times it's more of the fun stuff that they have. You know, we always ask what they recommend, kind of thing like that, or what their specialty is. Um, you can't ever go wrong with classic chocolate chips or anything like that. But a lot of these places in this day and age have a lot of fun, cool stuff that they have. Uh, and you always like to try everything, a little bit of everything. Yeah. You know, a lot of times it's, it, like I said, a lot of the classic recipes are stuff we do and then this day and age we also just like to try fun stuff, you know, I mean there's stuff that we've tried that didn't work and there's stuff that has stuck around like our s'mores cookies and our Rice Krispie cookies because we are in a college town, younger kids, that's kind of like it appeals to them a little bit more, um, the older crowd kind of thing like that, it's more like a wine drop or like a molasses type of cookie, um, but we just are thinking up new stuff all the time and we just try it out and see what happens, you know, there's a few regulars that we have in here that we're always willing to you know give out samples or something like that let them experiment try it out and they give us their feedback and if it's, for everyone yes too. exactly yeah. that's what I always like to say is that we try to have a little bit of something for everybody you know if you come in here you know we have gluten-free options uh, we have you know ice cream we have you know coffees and things like that we always like to have something that everybody would you know somebody would like kind of thing. yes we're happy to be here um, you know we're we, we appreciate all the support we've gotten from the community it's been amazing you know going on eight years this summer um, we wouldn't be here without the community kind of thing and that's one of the best things about being here is you know it's a small town thing you get to know everybody that's what I couldn't think of <laughs>